Hey guys, Stacy here with episode number 130. Let's play Star Stable. I've been sick. I was sick last week after the release of the new Yorvik Wild Horses, so I haven't been able to get online and check them out. So I'm standing here in front of them now. They're behind Wolf Pepper, down in the distance, and I'm so ready to get them. I'm so excited. <laughs> also, the new uh, Foles app was released. I think you guys watched my video about that. So I've been recording my progress, and once I purchase the horse and get it in the game, I'll do another video to show you guys. I just love it. I think it's so cool. And now I'm so excited to get the Yorvik Wild Horses. Yay! I hope you watched my episode of the Star Stable Game News that I got to participate in. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. And I thought they ended up doing a really good job editing it and putting it together. It was so much fun. <laughs> All right, let's make our way down there. Oh, good. They've loaded. They are so cool. I could not believe it when I saw the pictures. I heard the Yorvik Wild Horses were returning, but then... I saw them and I said, oh my gosh, they look like Shires. Not just any Shires, but Galloper Thompson's Shire. Of course, we can't have his. His is way too cool. <laughs> we could not handle that kind of horse. But look at their manes wave. Just, I don't know, from magic? The breeze? It can't be the breeze that's waving. It's like flames. It's like the flames on Galloper Thompson's. I don't know. It's just so cool. This one looks like a birthday cake. And the green one, which I wasn't entirely sold on at first, but I do love the mint green color, and I think his not wild coloring might be my favorite. And then, of course, any horse with electric blue, I'm going to love. And his coloring as well, when he's not wild, is really pretty. So we're going to get them all. We're going to check them out, wild, not wild, and maybe find some tack for them. I don't even know. Is he laughing at me? <laughs> I'm so bad with tack. These ones are especially hard. I have to agree with some of you. It's difficult because you want to get gear that looks good when both when they're colorful and not colorful. And when you're at the mall, you can't see what their colorful side looks like to match up tack. I'm bad enough as it is. That just makes it more complicated. Ugh. But I'm also among the group that would rather have them colorful all the time. Or maybe have a button that lets you choose. Be colorful. Don't be colorful. That would be pretty cool. I haven't picked any names or anything. I just know that I must have them because they're really, really cool. They're really special. Limited edition. So we need to get them now. Okay, allow me to introduce to you. Here they are. This one is Popstar. Over here we have Jade Joy. And finally, Doo Dollar. <laughs> um, I think Popstar took me the longest to name, but the other two just kind of came to me really quickly actually with do dollar i was like oh there everyone's gonna hate do dollar but i love it jade joy and pop star that's so cool all right let's take them out and see how they look all right wolf pepper let's get in here get in this stall over here love it oh, the, it's such a bright bright pink okay i'm gonna do something i saw total cretin do where she lined up her horses here when i was sick and i couldn't buy my yorvik wild horse i went online and watched everyone else buy their yorvik wild horse hers was one of my favorite videos i think <laughs> jade joy i love that the color it's like a golden green interesting very interesting. And then finally, oh, it even has a little pattern. It looks kind of like leaves. I'm not sure. Do dollar. Which from statistics I've seen, the most popular one out of the group. I mean, I could see why. He's beautiful. He's absolutely beautiful. Oh, so handsome. They're all so handsome. Oh, I haven't decided. Uh, Popstar is a girl. Uh, Doo Dollar is a boy. But I haven't decided if Jay Joy is going to be a boy or a girl. I don't know. <laughs> Nothing jumps out at me right away. So I'm not too worried about it. But I know a lot of people ask. I uh, haven't decided if Jay Joy is a boy or a girl. Maybe it will change every episode. Who knows? But get a look. This is what these fantastic beauties look like. 
colorful, then we'll head outside and check out what they look like a little less colorful. Okay, here's Doo Dollar in his amazing gray and black theme. You can compare him over here to the Frisians, which are also black. His coloring, they're a little bit shinier. He's a bit more matte. He's kind of like this one. Hello, Frisian friend. The new Frisians are some of my favorite horses in the game, but he looks so handsome. Love it. I, I can easily see why this is one of, like the favorite out of all of them. I love it. Oh, there's one right there. Hello, friend. What gear do they have on it? Oh, she disappeared. Oh, oh, it's the winter gear that we got uh, through the calendar. This here is Jade Joy, the green Yorvik Wild Horse. Um, this is absolutely beautiful. The white and the orange brown, orangey brown. Ooh, very beautiful. I like it a lot. Still with the moving mane. You cannot change the mane and tail on these horses because the other manes and tails don't have the color changing effect. So you kind of have to stick with these. But they, they wave as well. So <laughs> I think it's really cool. And lastly, the one, the only, Popstar! She looks so cool with the speckles. And the, it's, it's like a gradient. Her... Feathers and mane and tail are gradient. I love it. Fantastic and fun. Oh, so many people have asked for the Yorvik Wild Horses to return in any way, shape, or form since last year. I don't know for sure if the previous versions will be available again. I, I really have no idea. Or if these ones will be available again in the future. They're here until February 15th. Uh, but... They're here now, and they're beautiful, and I hope you guys like them as much as I do. Whee! <laughs> so I stuck on some of the gear I bought last time from the new shop in Yorvik City. On to Jay Joy here, who I wanted to ride because we don't have really any other horse that looks quite like this one. I think this, this metallic blue-green color looks fabulous. We need some more of that. Or maybe something that matches a little bit better. This is the saddle and reins that came out with this saddle pad, but I don't know. I really still am not sure how well they match. Anyway, I want to head back to Yorvik uh, City because I want to check out the beanies. I know there's a few new quests there. I don't know how many we can get done today, but I really want to check out the beanies and stuff. So we're going to head over in that direction. While we're standing here waiting for the bus to show up, because... They're back to the normal bus schedule. <laughs> I hate waiting. Um, this clipping that occurs, I know a lot of people have brought it up about the Shires. Uh, this happens because the reins have to be designed to fit all of the horses. So it's really tough to make one rein look the same on all these different horse models. So they don't quite fit the Shires correctly. It clips into their sides a little bit. Which, I know, it doesn't look realistic and it can be a little frustrating, but I, it's because of having to get it to fit so many different horses. Ponies, starters, all of them. Shires. So I feel like it's always going to look funny on one or another. Let's go on a search for... Oh yeah, I should also mention I love, I love the new character movement technique. Um, obviously you still use WASD to like move your character, but to control that movement, to toggle, run and walk, you hit shift. And I love that so much. The character will not, it used to be if you stop, if you switch to running and then stop or bump into something, you'd have to hit shift again, but now you don't. I can always be running until I don't want to be running anymore. <laughs> anyway, I'm looking for this beanie girl. Hello, beanie girl. Sell me your beanies. Hello. Hello, Beanie Girl. Nope, that's not Beanie Girl. That's Pants Man. Pants Lady. What's up, Pants Lady? Oh, this the weird Bermuda Shorts Girl or something. Donde esta Beanie Madam? That guy in the middle needs our help. But he's gonna have to wait. We're on a Beanie mission. 
Hello, beanies. <gasps> there she is. Hello, Annie, the beanie merchant. <laughs> Hello there. Oh, I love her jacket. What is your name, if I may ask? Cadence. Nice to meet you, Cadence. I see that you seem to be interested in one of the beanies. I have plans to open a shop here in the square and sell beanies, but I'd need an assistant to get started. If you're interested in a beanie, maybe you could help me get the store started? The beanies I've received are samples, and I have a couple of boxes of beanies I would need help to move over here. Could you go and get the boxes from the tram station? Um, sure. Oh, in the saddlebag, man. Hey, saddle... Oh, lady. It's another lady. Why do I keep calling them man? It's a lady. Oh, yes. So, tram station is over here. Here? Yes. Hey, Abigail. How's it going? One of three. Oh, okay. Uh, two, three. Perfect. I was worried I'd have to do a trip for each of them. No thanks. Here you are, Annie, the beanie merchant. Great, you got all the boxes. As you can see from the samples, the beanies are a mix of several different colors, and some with funny faces on them. Oh, oh. I am sure that they're going to be a hit. They are really comfortable and in style. Cadence, can you place the boxes that you picked up next to the stand here so I'll have enough beanies to open the store and start selling? Yes. Oh. Yes. Open for business. <clears throat> Great, now we have enough beanies to start selling. Now that we have enough beanies, we have to make sure that people know that a store will be opened here. A store is nothing without customers, and until now nobody knows that the best beanies in Yorvik City are out here in the alleyway at Aideen's Plaza. It would be a shame if no one was able to find them. I've printed flyers to be placed around the square. Could you put the flyers up in some different places here? Make sure that you spread them out so that they're not all in the same place. That, that sounds like a good, good plan. New no. blob of cloth. Hey, guy, wake up. There's new beanies. Wake up. Beanies. He does not care. I would love to sit here and have coffee. Ooh, there's that smelly dumpster. The flyers look great, Annie. Great, now people will, are sure to notice where they should buy their beanies. Now there's only one thing we need to get ready for the beanies to start selling like hotcakes. Although sunshine is not the best weather for beanies, it would be unfortunate if any customers might feel like butter. Butter. The best advertisement is a satisfied customer, Cadence, so if people start talking about the store in a positive manner, customers will flock here. Let's see, which one should we choose? Ah, yes, the pink one will be good. Here's a beanie, Cadence. Think of it as sort of a sample. It would be really good if you could take this beanie with you and walk casually around the city a little and show off the beanie for everyone to see. And if anyone is curious, you could tell them all about my beanies. Well, thank you. Oops. Oh, I thought I had to wear it. Okay. I was gonna put it on. Hello, Iris. Look at this beanie. Oh, what a great looking beanie you have. Hey, sleeping guy. Look at this beanie. He doesn't care. Tree man. Look at this. What a great looking beanie you have. Thanks. Hey, shady guy. Look at this beanie. Oops, I missed him. I'd love to have a beanie like that. Dancing ladies, look at this beanie. What a great looking beanie you have. Oh, the final sample lady. Where can I get a beanie like that? Why right around the corner with the beanie lady? They really liked her samples, Annie. How did it go, Cadence? Did people seem to be positive? They liked the beanie? Yay! You can keep that beanie as a reward for all of your help now that all these other people have tried it on. And you also have the honor of being the first customer to buy the beanie of your choice. Yay! Let's see what this one looks like first, though. I may not even like the beanies. Oh! I don't know how I feel about this one, but uh, we'll check out your other wares. And ooh, we don't need to run here. Chillax. Oh, can we? Uh, 
turn around maybe though oh okay there we go that's better blue purpley blue black Ooh. white oh i didn't even look at their stats riding plus four nice command plus five carrying plus three Ooh, i like that one it's like a, a raspberry maroon okay maroon Ooh, the brown is cool too oh i think that's what she's wearing green gray oh that matches my outfit uh no one has a face no way oh and happy lovey face and a kawaii face oh the striped is fun the blue is a little too much like my hair um that one matches the things that i'm wearing 102 102 why is that one the most expensive the one that i wanted to get mm. Um, should we go with the one with the face? Ooh, look, it's dizzy. It's dizzy. Let's get this one. You guys are going to hate me. I know it. But look at it. Ah! It's so dizzy. There, I changed my clothes a little bit. It, it matches a little bit better now that I put on black clothes <laughs> that I happen to have in my inventory. But regardless... I'm in love with that beanie. It's adorable. <laughs> I'm going to wrap it up here, my friends, because my voice is starting to hurt a little bit because I'm still recovering from my cold. But I could not wait any longer to get on and purchase the Yorvik Wild Horses. I think they're so cool. So let me know which ones you bought and what you named them and stuff. I love reading your name suggestions because you guys are way more creative than I am, I think, <laughs> with the names. But... They're still really, really cool, so let me know what you got and how your full raising is going. I would love to know. I can't wait to show you guys. Lucky Dust, all grown up. He's almost there. He grew up a little bit. I'm having so much fun doing the training. I like that it changes every day. I like that there's fun stuff to do that you don't normally get to do in Star Stable Online. It's pretty cool. So thank you for tuning in. Give a thumbs up if you like, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you next time. Bye!